In this video, I'm going to give you an introduction on how to use Tinker's Mod Designer for Minecraft. In the Tinker Mod Designer, there's a code block library on the left, and a search bar. This is where you can search for a specific code block if you already know the name. And if you ever need a short description of what a certain code block does, simply click on the block. This large area in the middle is the coding area. This is where you drag and connect your code blocks to make your mods. Along the top, we have the toolbar, where you can exit the mod designer, save your project, and deploy your mod into your private Minecraft server. First, you need to know there are three different block types. Event blocks trigger the code. Parameter blocks are placed into other code blocks and act as a value or an option. And operation blocks perform an action. You can differentiate these by the shape of the block. Now all the code blocks are divided into different categories. I'll go through some of these and give a short example to show how some of these blocks are applied.